Hi. Hi. Hey there. Hey there. Let's create a connection and enjoy the right. Come join us here at Open Minds. Hi, everybody. Welcome back to another Open Minds video lesson. I am Teacher Morgan. And in this lesson, we are going to be looking at some phrasal verbs with the verb to put. So let's have a look at the first slide. We have put and all of the different phrasal verbs which we're focusing on today. We have put up, put down, put on, put up with, put away, put something off and put in. What do these all mean? Let's have a look. Okay, the first one, put up. This is to raise something up in the air. For example, put up your hand. Put up your hand. Okay, let's have a look at the second one. Put down. So this is the opposite of put up. Put down your hand or in this example, put down your arms, or it could mean to insult somebody. For example, don't put me down, don't insult me. Okay, let's have a look at the next one. Put on, put on we use for when we apply our clothing. It can be shoes, t-shirts, put on my t-shirt, put on my gloves. In this example, it says, I'm putting on my hat. I'm putting on my hat. Okay, the next one, put up with. Now, this means to tolerate, to tolerate something or someone. Let's have a look at the example. I can't put up with this heat. It's too hot. I can't put up with it. I can't tolerate it. Let's have a look at the next one. Put away. Now, put away is to return something to its original position. In this example, I'm putting away my t-shirts. I'm returning my t-shirts. To their place and putting away my t-shirts. Okay, the next one, put something off. Now this is to delay something when you don't want to do it. For example, I don't want to do my homework so I'm putting it off. I'll do it tomorrow. Okay, the next one, put in. Now, this means to contribute, to help. For example, here, some money. I will put in for Mark's present. I will contribute, I will help. Okay, very good guys. That's all the phrasal verbs for this lesson. Have a look at the slide and see if you remember all of the phrasal verbs. Thanks guys, that's all for today. I hope I will see you guys in another lesson. Bye.